friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing an AliExpress haul. But first of all, before I get into the haul, I want to apologize for not being putting up videos lately. This is a really hard time of the year for me. Um, the last time I ever enjoyed Christmas was when my daughter was alive. And here's a picture of her. She um, passed away on January 6th, right after Christmas, so I really have a hard time with this time of year, so I get into depression and I don't want to do anything. I just want to stay in bed and do nothing. But anyways, before I start crying, let's get into the haul. The first thing that I got is... I opened this, I didn't open this, but like I opened the outside packaging of this because I wanted to make sure it was, um, I just wanted to make sure it was um, a glass one, but this is for my iPad that I'm getting for Christmas. So I don't want the screen to break, so I'm happy this came in in time before Christmas so when I open it on Christmas I can put it on right away and then it came with two kinds of wipes one says wipes remove wipes one removes excess dirt wipes oh wet Okay, so this one is wet, and this one is dry. So, I guess you use the wet one to clean the screen, and then use the dry one to dry the screen, and then you put the screen protector on. That's my assumption, but these, I have no clue what these are for. If anyone knows, please let me know, because I've never had an iPad. Or an iPad screen so the next thing I got were these twinkle lights and I'm going to use them in my background when I get my backdrop um, and what I liked about them is they're USB so I don't have to buy batteries all the time and here they are lit up I just never untangled them yet but they work perfectly and they're supposed to be like five meters here so that should like cover my whole background hopefully five meters is like 15 feet around so and I forgot how much this cost I don't know where oh Wait, I'll grab my book. I see it. Sorry for not being uh, organized. So. The USB lights were three dollars and eight cents, and I do not know when I ordered that screen protector. So I don't know how much that screen protector was because I don't remember when I ordered it but it wasn't more than like three dollars so I'm not gonna waste my time to keep looking through the book for the screen protector it was probably about three dollars the next thing I got this, my daughter ordered these and they're 
she doesn't have this kind of phone anymore, so I don't know what she's going to do with them. It was probably a dollar. And she got another one exactly the same. It's for the 5S. And she doesn't have that phone anymore. She has a 6 now. So... I don't know what we're going to do with those phone cases. Probably give them away to somebody who needs them. Not worth selling them. They're only a dollar. The next thing I got are these foot peel mask thingies. Milk and bamboo vinegar peeling. And like you stick your... there's the, Everything's in Chinese. But it says stick your foot in there. And you're supposed to, I watched a video online to see how to do it. You stick your foot in these little baggies. You leave them on for an hour. And then you remove it. And then within three to seven days, your foot will start to peel. I wish I knew how to edit so that I could do a video on this. And like show you guys on like day five or something like when my feet are starting to peel but I don't know how to like put two videos together and all that crap so what you see is what you get I don't have I don't edit nothing so this is me in the real life so maybe I'll do them and then do a quick little video when they start to peel like a little separate video I don't know. Leave, leave comments below if that's something you want to see. Some people don't want to see feet. <laughs> the next thing, oh, and though these were, I think they were like a dollar fifty each around. They weren't much. Foot mask, dollar forty each. So it was two eighty for both of them. Next thing I got is this little thing to put in my kitchen sink because I hate it when kids throw dishes in the sink and there's still food on there and then like rice and all that will go down the drain. But if I have this on, it'll catch everything and I can throw it in the garbage and it won't be going down my drain. And that was a dollar. I don't have scissors around. These just came in the mail today, so I haven't opened them. I do not know where my scissors are. But I think we could try and get them open. Okay, and this, I expected it to be a little bigger, but it's okay. It's one of those little macaroon thingies. And you open it up and you could like put your like Tylenol in there or whatever and throw it in your purse so if you get a headache at work you've got like a, a little container with Tylenol and that oh no wonder it was hard to put on it was putting it was on the wrong way so yeah it's cute it wasn't much uh, I don't know if it was 43 cents so yeah it wasn't much I didn't expect much there was another one that was bigger mm. I think that was like two bucks or something, but I wanted to see how big this one is first. It's, it's big enough for the purpose, just to like throw a tiny all in there or something. The next thing I got, the bag was only this big. And they put a card in my box to tell me go pick it up at the post office. So I thought, yes, my tripod's in. That's the only thing that I ordered that wouldn't fit in the mailbox. And I get there and they give me this dinky little package and I'm like, why didn't they just put it in the mailbox? It doesn't say, like, why. 
because they've been delivering mail to us for like months and this is the first time they sent us to the post office to pick it up but it's my pillowcase and it's my chucky now i just gotta get some cotton to put in there but i'm gonna put him away until next halloween he'll be going on my couch for the whole month of october I'm scared. I don't want to sleep with it because I'm scared I'll open my eyes and look at him and freak out or something. So he's not going on my bed. And the next thing I got also came in the mail today. Ooh, stuck on my finger. Oh, and this is from Doom. And I'm pretty sure I only paid a dollar for these earrings. And I like them because if you can see, focus. I don't know if you if it's focusing, but it says Michael Kors on there. It's just super hard to see because it's right around the... And Michael Kors is like an expensive brand. So I said, what the heck? They're only a dollar. We'll try them out. I love hearts. And the last thing that we got... I hope I didn't rip it. Okay, I didn't. This is also from June. I have hooded eyes, so I have the hardest time trying to do a winged eyeliner. Like, it's impossible. Like, so I got these to see if they could help. But we'll see if they work or not. My friend Lala said she'll do a video about how to do it with hooded eyes, so... Maybe once she does that video, I'll know what to do. But for now, I've been trying out all these products and nothing seems to be working. So that's everything I got in my AliExpress slash Joom because I didn't know there was two Joom products in there. And they don't, they don't mark on it if it's from Joom or... It doesn't say if it's from Joom or AliExpress. It would be handy if they did, but they don't. So that's all. That's all for today. Well, for this video, I'm doing another small little Dollarama haul soon. And I'm going to do the swatching of the e.l.f. palette. And then my daughter's gonna do a video with me with um, my daughter doing my makeup using only e.l.f. products. I said I wanted to change it up a little. I was gonna just me do it, but I want her to do it so she could feel included in some of my videos. So... Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time.